This is in Russia. Russia, we found. And it's kind of gray, green, and pink. It's tones. Let's see a little bit of the green there. Down in the East Coast, we're in Ontario, around Algonquin Park. See there, you can see the color a little bit better there. Probably be better outside. And you see the pine, well, it spruce or balsam needle stuck to the cap. And that probably indicates that it was sticky at one point, maybe tacky. Um, found you foraging did a video on a mushroom similar to this and I will link it in my description because he asked me to do a video of this mushroom and it looks like it stains on the gill a little bit uh, white cream kind of a light creamy gill very white stem Kind of see the color differences there. Looks like it stains on the stem. But it doesn't stain right away. Um, I marked the hill in the woods to see if it would stain. Um, sometimes they don't stain until you get back. It takes a little while. So I decided to stain it there. Oh, there you can see the color. Kind of gray, pinky, creamy, greeny tones to it. And very, it was, well, it's still tacky, but smooth. Um, there's no quilted top to this. No scales, more of a smooth cap, like Russia usually is. Um, there's the young one. Kind of hard to see the gill attachment. There we go. It's a little bit better. And then the gill attachment. I'm not. There we go. It was found in a mixed woods, uh, a lot of evergreen and hardwood. So you can really see the green tone there. Much love, everyone.